I knew Tove when I was 14. Um, he used to hang out in the neighborhood I used to be in, and he used to always call me his little sister. And I used to always call him my Winnie the Pooh. And we, we always been friends since then. And um, he was seeing that I was doing hair, and he always he was kept reaching out to me. But I was still like doing hair out of my house, and I was in someone else's salon also. And he just kept asking me to come here. And you know, one day I just said, okay, let's go. I'm here now. I'm a, hey, why you ain't tag me? Because you ain't say what you needed. Say, I, I, told you I, needed I did tell you I needed a, a hoverboard. Hey. Say my I, thought that, I thought he told me he needed a hoverboard. Well, he so said let your scooter. He said let scooter. I said He hoverboard. said no, he said scooter, but he said his daughter said she'll take a, a hoverboard, right? Yeah. yeah. I need a drone. A drone? Uh, yes. Well, I don't know. You might have to walk out the stove. With that bitch, like how you went, like how you went out self self checkout when TT seen you. Yeah, you gonna have to just go to the. No, they put it. No, they put it. I cannot, I cannot still. Go, I feel funny walking in public, but nah, ain't what to be in here. But you know, public got self checkout now too. I can't still. I don't know. I be putting it funny. I can't for real. You still and you still and you just saying something twice. That ain't what you feel. I can't do that. I still can't do it. Oh no. I have a pack of meat and like Kool-Aid packets. <laughs> oh yeah, I'll put some yeah, stuff Yeah, this like Kool-Aid packet for these steaks. They don't know what the fuck going on. <laughs> <laughs> how, how, how long they hit a big old deep, deep. I'm sitting there standing, bringing up shit, deep. I ain't care about what you put in that mother, oh, bag. I was so going to see you about a week ago, bitch. They got mine because I set my shit down. Yeah. That nigga told me, he said, oh yeah, I seen your wallet on the table, but uh, as soon as you pulled out them dudes that were right behind you, that I was circling oh, through the city place. Looking for a bitch. Man, I'm going to straight out. I never forget one time I lost my wallet. A bitch mailed me my shit. They mailed my wallet to me. They did that to be before, too. And had the money still in there. I said, oh, people. Yeah. Yeah. He, he, he had put a note. I had to pay, 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 pay for, the, uh, for, for the postage. So he took the money out of the paper post. He put the receipt in there. Touch the money and put the receipt in that bitch. The chain back in there and everything. I swear to God, bro. I was looking crazy, baby. But what had it been me? Sorry. Yeah, you better go to the cohide, boy. You need more people like that. Oh, you know what? Damn. I got caught stealing uh, a bag of yellow rice back when I was like, Maybe about 18, 19 years old, I done went in a goddamn, that's when they used to have Abbasin. I went in Abbasin. I done fucking bought the chicken, bought the curry powder, and stole the fucking rice. I'm talking about maybe the rice was like a dollar and 99 cents, something like a bag of yellow rice, some type of shit. Like a dollar and 99 cents. I steal the fucking rice. As I'm walking out the door, the man tapped me on my shoulder and said, hey, somebody wanna, uh, somebody wanna talk to you. So I already knew what it was, bitch. I go in my pocket, bitch, I got by, by the band on me. The man say, uh, no, nah, you know, come on upstairs. I go upstairs, the man looking at me like, man, what made you do that? I got all my jewelry on, I got at least about 800 to 1,000 out on me. And I just like, dog. I, I can't even lie, I don't even really know. Nigga, I ended up having to take a stealing class and spending $75 for a bag of nine, uh, a bag of yellow rice for a dollar 99 cents. I had my girl with me, she was crying. Oh man, I was so goddamn embarrassed, I ain't steal nothing else ever since. It would happen to you. You want somebody to put your shit back. You really? I ain't even gonna fuck with people, shit. That's and karma is real. That's what I'm trying to tell you. So and I, God don't bless that. So I you left that shit alone because I said, I ain't gonna miss my blessing. Because somebody gonna do that to you. This ain't gonna miss my blessing. I'm not getting money. I'm getting the money. Fuck the ID. I ain't got nothing. I don't want nothing. I want nothing. I found this. <laughs> I 
don't want to say I found it. Well, I want to say I found sometimes, this. Sometimes you yeah. never get it. One time yeah. I left the casino. Yeah. Girl, yeah. Right? We kept the casino. We talking and doing what he was. Dude, the dude got up. Him and his girl got up. Boom. When he got up, I seen that bitch fall. Boom. I yeah. seen his water fall. I ain't say shit. I told my girl, sit down, hurry up, sit down, sit on it. Like, so, you feel me? Nobody else see it. You know, casino thick, it's five people around. I'm like, sit on that bill real quick, sit on it. So, yeah, get that bitch, hand that bitch to me. She handed it to me, I threw it in my pocket. I know cameras everywhere in the casino. So, I slid in my pocket, I said, let me go to the bathroom. You know, went to the bathroom. When I went to that bathroom, like about two, three hundred dollars in that motherfucker. Yeah, I said, ooh, we're gonna have a good night tonight. Sure. People I hung around, it's like a job ain't gonna give you everything. So you always have to find another way to make some money. So, you know, I was in the streets, you know. I sold a little dope, sold a little here and there, you know, did a little something, you know. You know, because my background, so I ended up meeting a couple of people around people that was doing stuff like that. So it was just kind of like, like I already, you know, there for me. I just had to like jump in the water, you know. And the water was deep, you know, so. I ain't know it was that deep until I jumped into it. So, you know, as I got older, I had to, you know, I always been wise, you know. Like I say, I, I come from the Haitian background, so I always was taught better and I taught, you know, they had me go to church, so I always had God in my background. So a lot of that stuff helped me out to see a different way, you know, so I kept on getting in trouble. You know, I'm on probation right now, so. Only that fly fade, man. You get this shit here, nigga, all them remotes. So you can get all them about Bluetooth remotes. She took the shit home. We blame her for taking it home. Like, hey, shit, you remember? You just look for the motherfucker. They going at it like old couples in this. <laughs> what well, fuck you two then, Ernest? You, you rat bastard. <laughs> hey, like all niggas here. You fucking don't want to get. I like that. I like you. Oh, you think you? Oh, for real? So you think you? Oh, you think you get with me? All right. You gonna lose tonight? Fuck that. Fuck you too. Oh, I like a chat. Well, fuck you too then, Rufus. <laughs> <laughs> My father knew you go get my shotgun. Let's <laughs> see how we do it in Fly Fade, man. This is where we at, man, right here, man. 1784 North Congress, you hear me? The we got right now so far. We ain't got the whole staff here, but we got our, you know what I'm saying, our main hitter. Okay, he go Sam Styles. They go Mad Marie. If you see that shit, they go nigga Zoe. It takes some time. Why am I gonna be Mad Marie? Why the fuck am I gonna be Mad Marie? For the camera, dog. Nigga, nigga, you man, somebody like, who was told, like, who was a toe down and, you know what I'm saying, they don't say no negative shit, but you want that though, because to me. See, you gotta have all that. Listen. That gonna come with the game. You can't be, you can't be on top of people or. A certain status and yeah. negativity don't come with it. Yeah, that come, it come with that, territory. That, that just got to come with it. Cause when they used to get on me with the whole one that was sitting with the whole mud, I used to love that shit. Like, oh my god! You got, you got it. I got welcome all that, that shit. It got to go. It come with the territory. They come you, you can go read Rick Ross uh, coming right now, and, and and they're gonna get it to him. <laughs> every every go round. Every go round. Anybody. <laughs> Yeah. Now you want to see some comments? Listen, yeah. Go to, go to Rural Stop. Listen. Oh, man. The scariest shit. Rural Stop make you motherfuckers quit your career. <laughs> that negativity shit. One thing about negativity, that shit ain't going to get you nowhere. You know what I'm saying? If you look at a battery, you can't you can't uh, crank a car or, or do nothing with, 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 with two negatives. You know what I'm saying? You need some kind of positivity. Positive is, is stronger than negativity. You know what I mean? So. Like that negative shit, like me, I'm the type of person, if you're a negative person, if you're a person that's always talking about what you can't do or this, or even talking about somebody, or that, I can't have that shit around me, cause I'm the type of nigga, 
I don't need no negativity because I feel like I can do anything and I don't need no drama, none of that dumb shit. No, but I'm saying though, the scariest shit is not happening. Right. You feel me? Yeah. The scariest shit is that they ain't over there calling you bad or whatnot. Yeah. I'd rather have it than to. That's why That's why today when the, when the bitch being, you know, they have my name in their mouth, I'd be like, man, I'll listen. Thank you. Because I'm still, you know what I mean? That means I'm, I'm still doing something. You know, I you know I I keep everything professional. Man, listen, I done heard but, all you know about me, boy. That nigga there, he a that big gay, he a punk. That nigga did they all. Oh, oh, man. Thanks, she's back here. You where we at, man? Put on shampoo bowl, you know. We do everything in here, man. Hell, all that, man. We braid, twist, dread, whatever you want, man. Fade, blowout, mohawk, all that shit, man. This is a little office right here, you know. Anything come up missing, any fuck shit going on, we got you on this goddamn camera, you know what I'm saying? Any, any little fuck shit going on, we on you. I was just, I was off of work and then she uh, called me and I I guess, you know, I probably need to ride home so she like, she'll come get me or whatever. So she pulled up here and I don't know what transpired or what happened to make her even start it getting mad, I don't, I don't even, I don't understand. But like I say, it, you know, that happened plenty of times before, this ain't the first time, so. Hadouken! She, you know, she tried to attack me for some reason. I don't know what I said or what, I, what, what, what it was. And, you know, I had to restrain myself, so I restrained myself. And as the time I was doing that, you know, I, I kind of, you know, pushed her towards the glass and the chair, and the chair hit the glass, and it broke the glass, glass everywhere. She was bleeding, and you know, I'm cut, she cut. It's, it was crazy. I was like, oh, man. I did that. It happened, she called the police, so the police was, they came. So, you know, like I say, this ain't the first incident, so I already know how to handle myself, so that's why I really didn't, you know, put my hands on. I don't put my hands on women, so I, I, I you know, I didn't do it. I just restrained myself. So I already knew that I was on, gonna be all right anyway. When it come down to the police, so I just don't want to be all in their face talking to them at the time. Though, but so other than that, I won't really worry about the police. Cause I've been doing it. I've been dealt with them before. You know, I was on probation for like three years while I was dating her. So I was on a thin line anyway. So I already had to walk tight, walk right. You know, messing with you know female like that, so it was crazy. You get your little game back when you're dealing with aggressive women, man. One thing about it, boy, you cannot be a little too laid back, cause they're gonna take full advantage of you, cause they're aggressive anyway. You know what I'm saying? Them bitches aggressive in when they in the bed, they're aggressive on whatever they do. You know what I'm saying? So sometimes, goddamn it, you might have to. You know, you can't be a woman beating and put your hands on them, but you might have to yoke them up a little bit. Hey, hey, man, hold on, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? Or uh, you got to do something to let them know, hey, man, I don't play, you know what I mean? Because if not, you, you know, like I say, sometimes you might have to, hey, hey, come on now. <laughs> you know what I mean? Hey, man, stop all that there now. Because, you know, they don't play now. They going to motherfucking rough you up. One thing about people now, people run over you, man. It don't matter who the fuck he is now. If you gonna just sit there, motherfucker, just act like you, motherfucker, you ain't got nothing to say. Yeah, yeah. They gonna do what they wanna do to they you. They gonna do what they wanna do to you now. Yeah. Come on now, see, see, one thing about it, you can't run nothing. Yeah. If you ain't, if you scared to put on. Yeah. You know, and I don't put on in a, in a, in a, in a. You put down every Saturday. Hell yeah, I don't put he put down, down, he, he put down rent there, don't let them fool y'all. Yeah, rent, yeah. rent time come, he slapping clients and all, man. Yeah, my money, man. <laughs> he slapping clients and all about his little money, man. Oh, I'm going to be clapping for all the time. Employees, motherfucker. I, I got to keep coming here waiting till 6 o'clock to get that little motherfucking chain. Yo, come on, man. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, I need that motherfucking money on that motherfucker soon when I step in here. I shouldn't have to motherfucking wait till you cut motherfucking oh, five or six heads, man. Everybody want to be a boss or say they're a boss. 
but everybody can't be a boss, because a lot of the bosses get in their own way. You know what I'm saying? So a lot of these bosses, they, 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 they talking about their boss, but they got a problem with everybody. Or they talking about their boss, but uh, 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 they, they, they hating on they, they workers. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and another thing is when, when you being a real boss, you gotta be a, you gotta be smart and you gotta be a leader. You know what I'm saying? That would make a real boss. You know what I mean? A, a, a real boss make a way for his employees or his workers or whatever, and get out the way. You know what I'm saying? You you, you get out their way. You know me? I, I let I let this day shop. You know what I'm saying? I own the shop. You don't see the man that own Walmart running around that motherfucker. He like shoot not in here, man. He like shoot nah, you might hang over the balcony, man, about that money. <laughs> nigga hang out, that nigga hang over that rail about that money, boy. Hey, man, ain't, ain't, my no nigga. ain't no motherfucker reason I got to come here. You Wait. got seven days. Come on, man. To, to pack that little change up. Now when I get here, you wanna hustle it up. They can't do that. You wanna they hustle it up now. Now I gotta sit here, motherfucker, and wait on you, the motherfucker. Yeah. Don't put the camera on me. Cut all these motherfuckers. I pay mine on time. Here, <laughs> <laughs> don't put the camera on me. You put it like he's talking about me. No, I, I pay on time. I pay on Friday. I don't know how I rock. I ain't nothing. Listen, boy, big boy shit over here. Sunday of January. You pay that. Pay my shit off right there. I give him money Friday evening. There you go. Oh, yeah, but real, man. I be like, damn, but real, what the hell is money for? Yeah, I just want to go. Yeah, yeah, so the fair be over by then. Don't get this on that. No, the fair over the first. Don't get this on that. I don't want no problem with the toe, man. Not at all. We got too many hitters on this team, man.